in this part of the tutorial I just want to review uh, what's underneath the edit area of the program so we're at the main menu uh, screen where we can either enter the 3d application or the rehabilitation application and as I go to the edit menu option there are a couple of things I wanted to discuss uh, first just real quick the clinic information uh, you can put in your address your phone number and fax and update that and when you send out reports that information will also uh, be either printed or it will be on the email that's sent out as a report so you'll need to once you uh, install the program you'll need to update those things also there's some general preferences that you can change so as your um, general instructions you can either include large fonts or no notes and you can customize your reports here uh, you can <clears throat> either have endurance or strength or also the email a server is is the 3drx server right now you can change that to be your server if you'd like to send emails through your server and that would be something that your IT specialist would uh, change over for you if, if you'd like to otherwise it will just go out uh, through the 3drx server and under report uh, you can click on the logo right now it's a default logo of 3drx insight if you click on the logo then you can go out on your computer um, hard drive and then select your uh, actual logo for your clinic and then that will show up on the reports as well so that's something that you would want to go in and, and update your logo uh, and maybe change some of your general preferences if you wanted to uh, so those are the things that I wanted to just cover uh, in the edit section the, the last last thing to cover in the edit section is the playlist uh, exporting a playlist and importing a playlist so if you've already watched the advanced tutorial on how to create a playlist uh, then you, the uh, other option that you have once you have created a playlist you can export that playlist and then anybody uh, that that has the 3drx insight program can import that playlist so they don't have to recreate it so if you have a nice playlist you put together and you want to export that and then you can send it to somebody or you can make it available to them and then they can go to the import playlist and this works also with the rehabilitation side as you have custom rehabilitation uh, playlists that you've created uh, you can import those as well so when you go to export then you can select which playlists you want to uh, export and then hit browse and and save them out to your hard drive and then you can send those playlists uh, to um, people that are, are also using the program uh, co-workers or or uh, other people in the office that are using the program can also import those so they don't have to recreate them and that kind of wraps up the the you know the edit section um, and I'll talk more about custom exercises in our in our next tutorial